Well, um, my name is Fred Clark, and I did a course in fine arts um, at the University of Witz, where I didn't actually do printmaking, funnily enough, the department was lacking um, on the printmaking side of things. So I kind of discovered it by myself, and um, I did a couple of hand prints, um, and then went down to a place in, in, in White River and, and got a body of work together. And then when I came back to Joburg, um, I thought, what should I do with this? And a couple of people recommended I, I go and talk to David because he was very um, cool with a sort of up-and-coming artists. And, uh, and so, yeah, I, I, I made a, a meeting with him. And um, his support was fantastic because he invited me to come in and work in his studio. Um, and that was, I, I collaborated with Lungi, um, who I'd never met before. And it was really cool to meet someone that uh, was so relaxed in the studio. And I think we just got on really well. And the, the suggestions that flew between us were, were interesting because I think the whole point of a collaboration is to, um, to challenge each other or for the, for, the, uh, for the printer to bring elements out of the artist that they didn't really know were there or were lying dormant kind of thing. Mm. I think... <coughs> Now's a good time to actually talk about this one. This was the, the, the very first um, one that, that I did when I was w working here. And you can actually see the, the, the figures, they're quite like polite in a way compared to how elusive it got later. But right at the end of our session, um, here Lungi said, why don't you just go for it with, with ink, not printed, but painted ink over this. And just you know, like have fun basically. And I think it worked really well. The work itself, the subject matter. I came in here with the rough idea to. Um, I like using the natural world as, as reference in, in my work, and especially humans in relation to that. And it's obviously a quite an explored territory. But what I I wanted to do was have um, kind of death matches between different animals but totally mess with the size so like an, elef an elephant versus an ant and, and then have little humans around watching these these sort of clashes because um, we've sort of become voyeurs of nature in a way but through through TV and and through a knowledge of, of the thing but not really experiencing it directly so that's basically what the work is about but I'm, my hope is that they just um, are able to stand on their own two feet as, as images and um, a, a lot of the work here was about mark making and about freeing it up, making it a gestural, you know, and, and that was what was so nice as the, uh, the sessions progressed because um, each day it would kind of get looser and, uh, and let the ink play a bit and I was using my hands and rags and stuff and, and just really just having fun basically and it was very cool to be in a space that allowed for that.